Hey guys, I'm retired Navy SEAL sniper instructor Chris Sinog and the founder of the New Rules of Marksmanship training system. In this video, I want to discuss whether you should focus on your front sight or not. Now let's go ahead and get started. Joining me now is retired Navy SEAL sniper Chris Sinog. All right, so when it comes to whether you should focus on your front sight or not focus on your front sight, there is a lot of debate going on out there and I want to try to clear this up for everybody. Now, when it comes to training, I hope we can all agree that we want to train for perfection. And I think we can also agree that there is a reason that on your pistol, you have two pieces of metal sticking up, one on the front and one on the back. And those are designed to make you able to hit your target where you want it. So when you train, you want to train to be able to focus on that front sight so you can hit targets that are either farther away or they're smaller. So you need to be more accurate. And through training and repetition, your ability to focus and line up your sights is going to become faster and faster. And that is what I talk about when I say paving your path to perfection. You're literally building neural pathways that allow you to quickly and smoothly do those repetitions that you've been practicing at home. Now, on the other end of the spectrum, of course, if you have a target that is right in front of you, say somebody comes up and pulls a gun on you and you want to shoot them, they're so close that you don't need to line up your front sight. You just point your gun at them and you're gonna shoot them because you're so close. Then, of course, you don't need to focus on your front sight. But again, if we train to never look at our front sights, we're not going to be able to take those farther shots because we've never practiced at it. So I have a sliding scale and that sliding scale for me goes to sight priority focus or target priority focus. So with site priority focus, your priority is a more crystal clear focus on your front sight. Now that's gonna be, again, for a target that is further away, so a long distance shot, or a target that is smaller and you need to be more accurate. Now on the other side of the scale, you have target priority focus. If there is a target that's right in front of you, your focus needs to be on that target. Again, that is shots that are gonna be so close that it's just gonna take more time to actually actually line up your sights and take that shot. You don't need to because it's so close. So what I want you to do is just remember it's a sliding scale. It's not one or the other. If it's further away, you're going to need to focus and you're going to need to practice that way. And it, again, if it's closer, you're just not going to need to use the sights, but you're able to if you need to use them. So that is it for today. I hope that cleared up some questions that you might have had and helped you out. And until next time, keep paving your path to perfection. Hey, I really hope you enjoyed watching that video. And if you did, I put together my top three videos for learning to shoot at home. And I want to give those to you absolutely free. Now, all you have to do is click the I card that just popped up or you can go to chrissinog.com forward slash free videos and I will send you not only those top three videos that I have for learning to shoot at home, but I will also send you a free PDF copy of my new rules of marksmanship manifesto. Click the card, go to chrissinog.com forward slash free videos so I can send you those videos. Keep paving your path to perfection, guys.